Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why would they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of... He's had a shot! Has gone out. Another chance from a corner. Had a shot. Oh, that's a waste. Well, I think a little eagerness just got the better of him. He may have been thinking about back page headlines there. Oh, good interception. Plays it out to the wing. Gets away from his opponent. Defence has got rid of that. Oh, Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Oh, he's broken through. Chance! And that really is so, so impressive. Barcelona have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Puts in a cross. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. Ericsson. Ricate tries to get it forward quickly. Goes for goal! Sticks it away! And they're at it again in double quick time! Well, that defence just wasn't expecting their midfield to mess up then, so when they did, they were caught completely cold by such a swift breakaway and such a well worked finish, too. Barcelona get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other.
Sit into the pass himself at it. He has done it with half time at hand. Perfect timing. Oh, super header, wonderfully acrobatic. He had a choice of trying to volley that and get his head to it, and I'm pleased to say he took the right option. That's a great goal. We have got ourselves a game here. Listen, goals change games, and that has changed the whole complexion of this one. They have the momentum now. Gets the better of his man. That intervention was very necessary. And the half-time whistle goes. So a really good half of football. Three goals, and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Well, it remains very delicately poised, and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. Very little in it. The score at half-time is two goals to one. So we're just settling back into this second half. Beckham gets it out to the wing. It is quite a run he's making here. Bitten court goes looking out to the right. Beckham. Hetic. Eriksson. Vasil. Thiago Silva. This is quite a run and he's not done yet. He's making good use of his strength there. Massive leap! Went with his head, but couldn't steer it in. De Pablo pings it out wide. And he's cut it out. Thiago Silva. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. He gets past his man. Has a hit! Should have equalized. I oh, can't hide away from how important that was. To Pablo. And the shot! He should have put that one away. Ganduzi really did let them off the hook. They could have wrapped it all up.
Played out to the right. Surely this is the last chance now. Going through. Arsenal have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Barcelona just have to run down the clock. To Pablo. Beckham. And the referee brings it to a close. Barcelona win it by the odd goal. Almost nothing in it. Perhaps a draw would have felt fairer. But that's the game. And they have...